morning. Can I do your coffee? I already did my coffee. Mm. I had my cold brew. I had that one. So what are we gonna make? Healthy pancakes. Are pancakes healthy? Depends on how you make them. Huh? What are you gonna put in it? I don't know. Yes, you do. Banana, that's all. Bananas, and what else? Oats. Oats, and? Sprinkles and chocolate chips and sprinkles and sprinkles. Yeah, and? Eggs. Eggs. Two eggs, one banana, quarter cup of oats, and we add chocolate chips and sprinkles, right? Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. Can you reach over there now? I can throw one. I can throw one. No, don't throw it in there. Mommy, you need to help, help, help. Help. Yeah. Where's all of our light? Where's all of our light? Today I want to give you a little update on the house and how everything is coming along. It is not perfect by far. We are getting there and it's been a week and a half but in that time there was Thanksgiving and then Brielle was sick with a fever for like five days and we just have not had time to really knock everything out in one day so let me show you what we've done so far. It's getting there. We have a few other big pieces of things we need to do, but it's coming along. I just was able to do some meal planning for the first time since we've moved. I did a Walmart grocery pickup, and um, we are just one day at a time. Moving is just so much work, and especially with two little kids, plus trying to keep up on YouTube, um, it's a lot. So let me show you what we've done so far. So here is the um, cube shelf that we got from Ikea. And it separates our workspace, which, check it out guys. We now have matching chairs and each have a setup. It's kind of crazy, isn't it? So my side's here, Brandon's side's there. I don't know what we're doing with all of this. Stuff, but we put the freezer here. I don't know where all this is going. I hung up our little um, command center thing that shows everyone's folder. We've got some backpacks here, our utility area. So the side is laundry, which you saw before. Here's some laundry I need to do down here. And we got a new washer actually. When I was first using the washer, it got to the spin cycle and it was like, like 
sounded like it was a rocket ship taking off. So I texted the landlord and I was like, hey, you know, this thing is moving so much and it's hitting the dryer and the wall and the dryer's new. And so she talked to me and she's like, okay, well, I don't really want to fix it because I don't want to have the same problem again, so I'm just going to get a new one. So I was like, great. So we ended up getting a bigger one, which was awesome because the other one was really small and I could barely fit in like a decent sized load and this one is perfect. So thank the Lord for that. Um, definitely a blessing and um, very excited about that. So, okay, when you turn around from the laundry, then you turn to the utility area, which is still kind of also a work in progress because we have to maybe put a shelf up here to use some of that space, and all of this space back here is like loaded with stuff. Can't even really see it because there's so much stuff in the way. But, not that. So the kitchen is here. Put our Berkey there, cold brew. That was in our old kitchen. This is all stuff from the computer build that's gonna go. And um, here's from my Walmart grocery pickup, which if you have never done, I'm gonna put a link in the description box below. Check it out because it's so easy. It has saved me so much time and I can't even tell you, like I just, as I'm going through my day, I add um, the items that I need to my cart and then when I'm ready to check out I just do it the night before and I pick a time for the next day and it's just so easy I don't have to bring the kids in and just with all of the craziness of moving it has been such a lifesaver So if you haven't check it out below There's a link that you can click and it'll give you ten dollars off your first order if you've never done it So check out below Brandon was gonna switch the door around so it opens the other way which obviously would make sense Started it, had the two kids by himself, <laughs> ended up having to like put it back on because it was like insanity and stuff and he couldn't finish it, he needs some more tools, so. Um, I'm hanging some stuff up there. We took off this door because it would hit this, which is just ridiculous, like this vent fan, like, I don't know, it was, so I took it off and it solved our problem. We did have to get the microwave, which we got like on sale on Black Friday. So it's coming along. Um, this is all computer stuff that needs to be put away. And check me out and my new camera. Ooh, ooh. Um, hung some curtains just on the rod that was there, but they're really nice. We got them actually, I don't know if you can see, from Home Depot. And they're like a gray, they were pretty gray. Can't see with the light, but. Um, here's our outside area, still coming along. Don't know where we're gonna keep these. This cart, let me tell you, has been so helpful. Whenever I have groceries, or even just to bring Brielle in and out from the car, it's such a lifesaver. I don't have to like bend over, and it's just, I highly recommend it. I think we got it on Amazon, I can link it down below. Um, the different colors are different, like amounts of money so I just chose the cheapest one which happened to be this like army green but whatever I don't really care and it saved me like 10 to 15 dollars which is just crazy so check it out below if you are interested it's awesome the living room area we hung up our things for our keys oh we hung up the trones here which was great um and then our shoe area uh we've got this cube here and the whole living room, the other cube shelf is over there. We decorated a little for Christmas, you guys. So, I'm not sure how this will all end up being, but right now we've got her little rocker and stand-up thingies and whatever. Bookshelves fit super nice in there. It's awesome. And our cute little fireplace. Bookshelf over here. We got these sconces that one and that one on Amazon and we're gonna hang this up here and then like pictures are gonna come last you guys oh so Black Friday we got this at Costco which is super soft and this at Ikea and they just we needed some other pillows because it was ready karate chop yeah. and it looks great oh and Brielle's crying okay I'm trying to put them for nap, but not working so much. Okay, so that's that side, which has books and stuff, but over here, I have some toys 
because you can't really see this from the door, so Benjamin's blocks and tools and there's a speaker, more toys, sheets for forts and whatever. And then this is Christmas stuff that once we take out what we need, it's gonna go upstairs in the studio. This is our room, it's total disaster, so I don't know what's gonna happen. This is stuff for our bed. Under here is stuff for our bed and laundry. And the bed's not made and look what happened, you guys. There was a shelf there. There's one there. Let me tell you what happens. Okay, so I'm sitting here on the bed one day and all of a sudden I hear and then the entire shelf falls down, breaks curtains like it was a disaster. So um, we're actually gonna pick up a bookshelf and put it in the middle here so then we can attach a rod on either side. Benjamin, you need to be sleeping. No, you didn't. You didn't take a nap. Oh, my battery's gonna die. All right, gotta go charge it. Say bye. Bye. What's up, guys? It's a different day. I got interrupted. It was two days ago. Now I have off, so I'm gonna give you an update on what else is going on. Actually, since then, we were able to clean up a little last night downstairs, so I'll show you again that. But let me show you what we're gonna do in the closet because we did get the bookshelf and um, we're gonna be finally, hopefully, like this weekend, putting all the stuff away so I can clear out the bedroom. Okay, let me show you what we got. Bookshelf from online, from somebody, 20 bucks. And we're gonna do two rods so that we can hang clothes and then like a shelf on top. Um, so we have to do all of that. And finally, we can get all of these clothes that are on top of our bed pieces put away. So I'm very excited for that. This will be my side. This will be Brandon's side. Here I've got some uh, Christmas presents for Benjamin. Focus. Okay. So we're gonna do that. And so this is the bed unmade because that's how we roll right now. And um, over here is gonna be my dresser with that mirror on it. And our headboard is over there. Bathroom is here. I hung up this curtain right here so that you can still like section it off. You know, I mean there's a door for the toilet right here, but I don't know, it's kind of nice. Like then the bright light is not in Brandon's eyes. I had to get a new shower curtain because this is not a tub and all those shower curtains are for tubs. So I had to get an extra long one. It's like 96 inches or something. And um, cause water was like pouring out. Even when I put it super low and it was like like this high, which is like lower than my head. So I had to get that. A couple things we had to get when we were here. Here's the closet. Got some towels and toilet paper and sheets and more extra bedding. All right, I haven't even gotten to cleaning everything yet, but just trying to organize it. So we've got some stuff down here. Trying to just put all the little stuff away. And uh, so let me show you the kids' room. Laundry, I need to fold. All right, here's the kids' room. And still trying to put stuff away here. We've got um, curtains up here that we need to hang. And all of this is just like extra toys or toys I'm trying to rotate. This is like a foam mattress. There's extra, I don't even know, pillows and stuff. So here's Brielle's. I need to do some rearranging, but I'm trying to get all the big pieces away, you know. So he has some room back here, actually, that I'm gonna be able to put some stuff. And then I got extra storage up here. But this is their room. All of her clothes are in the dresser, but all of his clothes are down here. So, working on it. And their bathroom is probably not gonna look much different, but, um, Getting some stuff put away. I got a shower curtain up. I did this little hack for his toys because usually I, I put the toys there and he can't reach them unless I get to them. And then I can just take it off and then oh, let him pick some toys so they're not like a bazillion in the tub that, oh, 
that get moldy and whatever. So, put a little hook for him, which he can reach, and then I just hang reels up here. And I love the ones with hoodies, they're just so cute. I got that from Ikea. So anyways, that's that. I don't know, did I show you guys this thing that I got? I showed it to you, but I don't know since we put stuff in it. So all his like underwear and pajama tops and the pajama bottoms are down there. So he can get dressed in here after bath time. And I have extra storage. It's actually a really good setup here. And we have a lot of extra space. So I'm trying to keep it open spaces so that um, I have a little extra playroom. Okay, here's the studio. And it's right now a catch-all. <laughs> the plan is to be able to film here with all of this beautiful natural light coming in and be able to sit here, put the coffee table like here and just be able to do like some talking stuff and um, I don't know, whatever else we're gonna do. Um, so right now it's just we have Christmas stuff and picture frames and boxes and once we get our closet done, I'll be able to move some of this to store in there and it'll just be a lot better but for right now it's like a catch all but I really want to get it under control because I want to be able to film in here and do some videos with Brandon and I don't know just some um, some videos that we hope will add value to you guys and um, teach you something or help you or encourage you something like that so um, this is the upstairs let me show you real quick the downstairs and um, guys it's just a work in progress okay so let's keep that in mind all right, let's go. Ta-da! This was all junk last time. Well, not junk, but we needed to put it away. So, here's our YouTube studios. We're thinking of putting like an OFB sign for our family bee right there with some like sound panels that we had in the old place. I don't know, it would be really cute. This we're gonna flip and like put on the wall. Not sure where we're gonna put this yet, but kind of cleared this off. Maybe we'll put the printer up here. I don't know, but I'm really loving the flow of this house, guys. Oh, and we put this over here and it fits perfectly right there, which is kind of cool. I think we'll keep it there maybe. I'm not really sure where to do with this because I want it accessible, but not in the middle of the way. Cleared off the dining room table. We can actually eat here and I'm so excited. I don't know where we should hang his whiteboard, probably in the uh, hallway upstairs or something. But anyways, dishes there and it's really coming together. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the update and the progress of what we're doing. We still have a lot to do. It's all the little things now, except for like our bed and the closet. But then it's hanging pictures and like some decor stuff, which I like to keep minimal because I don't like dusting around it and I just don't like, don't like a lot of tchotchkes and stuff. But, um, Really excited, and oh, we hung our family values. I don't know, can you see? Our family values are wisdom, generosity, trust, gratitude, and love. And our family verse is right here. Anyways, if you guys aren't subscribed, hit the subscribe button down below and make sure you hit the bell so that you can get notifications when we post a new video, which is we try two times a week. And also check us out on our website, which is ourfamilybee.com, and follow us on social media at Our Family Bee Social. We try to keep up there. It is a lot of work, but we would love to see you guys there and comment so that we can get to know you. We want to build community, and um, we're really excited to be able to do this. So we'll see you next time. And don't forget, life is better together.